everyone. Now the launching ceremony of hub number 1227, ordered by Department of Transportation, Republic of the Philippines is commenced. First of all, we would like to present a bouquet to the sponsor, Minister Ducro. <laughs> Next, the priest will pray for the safety of the voyage of the ship. Receive our prayer, O Lord, as we ask for your protection. Preserve this vessel from misfortunes due to rough weather or due complex. May all who bought this vessel contribute to the great mission of enhancing security and peace on the seas and arrive safely at the harbor they aim to reach. We ask this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. May the abundant blessing of God, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit be on all who have planned commissioned and constructed this ship and with all who will be engaged in the various services it will be called to render. National anthems of Republic of the Philippines in Japan will be played. Mr. Kitamura, President and CEO of Mitsubishi Shipbuilding, will make an address. It's a great honor and pleasure to have you with us on the occasion of this launching ceremony which is an important milestone of the Advanced Multiple Response Special Project. I would especially like to welcome Secretary Tsugade, Under Secretary Rusabia, 
attending remotely. Admiral Laroya also attending remotely. Minister Dukroma, Commander Koroma, His Excellency Ambassador Kazuhiko Koshikawa also attending remotely, and all of our esteemed guests to our Shimonoseki shipyard. Taking this opportunity, we'd like to express our sincere gratitude to all of the members of the Department of Transportation and the Philippine Coast Guard for their excellent support to us to this date. It gives me tremendous pride to stand here with all of you next to this symbol of technology and cooperation. Today, a ship weighing about 2,200 tons will slide into the sea in front of us and float in the common strait. This is a truly touching tradition, and we are delighted to be able to share this wonderful moment with you. Indeed, it reminds us that we are connected to each other through this project across this glorious sea. After this launching, we will start the outfitting work on a full scale towards her completion, scheduled in July next year. And the first vessel launched earlier in July will be completed in April next year. Please rest assured that we, we will work with safety as our top priority and dedicate our service to its completion. We appreciate your continued guidance and encouragement as we move to this next stage. Finally, I sincere wish all of you every success and good health. Thank you very much. We are also pleased to share a message from Mr. Tuge, Secretary of the Department of Transportation from Philippines, represented by Admiral Rusevia, and the Secretary for Maritime Department of Transportation. His Excellency Kazuhiko Koshikawa, Ambassador of Japan to the Philippines, Madam Evangeline Ong Jimenez Dukruk, Minister for Political Affairs, Embassy for the Republic of the Philippines, Tokyo, Assistant Secretary Giovanni Lopez, Assistant Secretary for Project Implementation of the Department of Transportation, Vice Admiral Narciso Bingson Jr., the Assistant Secretary for Maritime Department of Transportation, Coast Guard Admiral Leopoldo Daroya, Commandant of the Philippine Coast Guard, Deputy Director General Jun Kondo, Engineering Affairs, Ministry of Land Infrastructure, Transport and Tourism, Director Daisuke Watanabe, Director Southeast Asia and Pacific Department, Japan International Cooperation Agency, Mr. Turo Kitamura, President and CEO, Mitsubishi Shipbuilding Corporation Limited, Mr. Hiroyuki Takeda, Senior Vice President, Regional Representative for Shimonoseki Mitsubishi Shipbuilding Corporation Limited, Mr. Kuta Kobayashi, Assistant Director, First Country Assistance Planning Division, Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Mr. Suishi Iwanami, Senior Corporate Advisor, Mitsubishi Heavy Industries Limited, Director Norikazu Iguchi, Director for Coast Guard International Cooperation, Japan Coast Guard, Mr. Mahabsar Lukman, Attaché and Assistant for Political Affairs, Director Managing Executive Officer, Masayuki Kawase, Japan Marine Science Incorporated, General Manager Tokuji Koyama, Toyota Chushu Corporation, 
and Mr. Eagle Azotizawa, JICA Philippines Chief Representative. To all who are present, be it virtual or in person, in today's event, a pleasant day to all of you. I am deeply humbled and honored to be with you on this momentous occasion to represent no less than the Secretary of Transportation, Secretary Artur Tugade. Unfortunately, in as much as the good secretary would, be, would like to be with us, he needs to attend an equally important earlier commitment. Be that as it may, allow me to read this message for this important undertaking. And I quote, it gives me great pleasure and honor to be speaking in this occasion, although I wish to have personally joined you in this important celebration today. Amid the challenges and setbacks brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic, I am exceedingly grateful to see how the projects and initiatives of the Department of Transportation in partnership with the Japanese government and the Mitsubishi Shipbuilding continue to make remarkable headway. With decades long friendship, coupled with a solid partnership aimed at realizing numerous development projects, the Philippines and Japan had furthermore solidified a bond that withstood the tides of time. Through the years, our Japanese partners have been one of our closest development allies, connection reinforced by Japan's continued contribution to the Philippines' growth. I look forward to more joint endeavors in the future as we continue to build our nation and serve our countrymen. Today, we mark another important milestone with the launching of the second approximately 94 meter multi-role response vessels for the Philippine Coast Guard, one of the largest maritime assets of the Philippine Coast Guard to date. The acquisition of these vessels under the Maritime Safety Capability Improvement Project Phase Two will significantly improve the PCG's response capabilities in maritime search and rescue, law enforcement, humanitarian assistance, and disaster response operations. These new vessels represent another significant step forward in our continuing efforts to modernize the Philippine Coast Guard. Moreover, with, with its prime features, this new security asset will greatly safeguard our country's maritime resources and ensure the observance of the rule of law in the country's maritime jurisdiction. At this time, I want to take this opportunity to acknowledge our esteemed partners in this initiative for their sustained and unrelenting efforts. The Mitsubishi Shipbuilding, and its excellent workers, and the Japan International Cooperation Agency, or JICA. Your hard work, dedication, cooperation, and trust given to us further strengthen our resolve to continue promoting lasting progress that will benefit both our nations and our people. Once more, allow me to express my deepest gratitude to everyone who contributed to this endeavor. It is an honor and pleasant duty to be with you all today. Dumo arigato gusaymas. Mabuhay. And I unko. Thank you very much. Now, we commence the launching process. The first 
signal bell was rung. This bell is a sign to commence the launching work. Yes, yes. The second signal bell was rung. This bell is a sign to remove the ship's support. Yes, yes. The third signal bell was rung. This bell is a sign to remove the safety device. The ship is now supported by the trigger and ready for launching. Yes, yes. C C 準備が完了しました。試行ご説断お願いします。Everyone, the cordon will be cut by Minister Ducro. For the Republic of the Philippines, I launch this ship. May God bless her and all who sail in her.
治水完了いたしました Everyone, the launching of the ship has been successfully completed. Congratulations and thank you for your attendance today. The commemorative photograph will be taken shortly. Now we are ready for a commemorative photograph. Please stand at the position of flying. The staff's instruction. Thank you. The ceremony will end.
Firstly, the ambassador moved by car. Please move to downstairs. バスに乗車される方は恐れ入りますが準備が整いますまで今しばらくこの場にてお待ちくださいますようお願い申し上げます。お待たせいたしましたバスに乗車される方は式台下にお進みください大変お待たせいたしました。